A Chester County School District reports its entire student population had their personal information compromised in a data breach. Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. And I'm Natasha Brown in for Jessica Cartalia. The Downingtown Area School District says it was a student who hacked the system. Eyewitness News reporter Howard Monroe joins us now live from Downingtown with more information for us. Howard. Well, they're saying that this prank all happened so the student can gain a competitive advantage in a game called the Senior Water Games. That's when the students up here, they go around town shooting water guns at each other. A district spokesperson says despite this being a prank, they are taking it very seriously. They were looking for student addresses to stake out uh, and try and target each other. A student prank going too far. Officials with the Downingtown Area School District says a student accessed the district's systems all over a game. The breach was first discovered last Friday. Officials say a student was able to use coding methods to gain access to a student portal known as Naviance. The website helps students with their post high school plans. Officials are now urging all employees and students to change their passwords. Makes me kind of nervous knowing somebody could hack into our school system. I trust my school district and I trust that they're handling it and I trust that they're keeping my, you know, our information, you know, confidential mm -hmm. and I know they have a handle on things. A school district spokesperson says the hacker gained access to a range of private information, student identifications, grade point averages, addresses, phone numbers, genders, and ethnicities. The district says much of that information would typically only be available to administrators and teachers. Officials say no information was manipulated and that no social security numbers were compromised. An attack like this is an attack not only on the school district, but it's also an attack on our students and their families. Now, the district is saying that they're now urging everyone to go out there and change their passwords. Also, they are also modifying their internal systems. Now, coming up when we see you at 6 o'clock, hear from a cybersecurity expert about what we should all do now, especially in these times. But for now, live in Downingtown, Howard Monroe, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Howard, we'll see you shortly. Thank you.